I can remember a flight attendant uh, telling me uh, a story about um, uh, they were taxiing. Um, the, um, it was a 707, so the, the situation of the door and where the galley was and where they were in the, in the cabin. And um, the, the captain called back and, and he said, oh, could you go and check the, uh, the back door? It's, it's showing it's, it's not uh, um, closed. So she went back there and the door was open. It was flat against the fuselage. So instead of calling up to the front, because we had no procedures, we, we weren't clear on, you know, there weren't great safety procedures then. Instead of calling to the front and saying, oh, it's open, can you stop? She's groping around trying to pull it in while the thing's taxing. It's, it's amazing that uh, uh, we got through a lot of things without uh, some pretty horrible accident. There was always a fight about putting things in the overhead racks. They expected us to, um, to get up when we landed, when the passengers had to stay in the seats and take things out of, take the coats down and hand them to the passengers. That was really unsafe really unsafe. And if it hadn't been for our health and safety committees, those things wouldn't have changed. So I'm happy to be in a union. I've seen the changes that the unions made for me.